Hi guys, it is me, Mao Zedong Oolong, back at it again. So basically, I went down to my bank teller today, again, <laughs> and I ended up getting, this time, 200 and quarters and 100 and dimes. And the dimes that I got today, one of the rolls actually has a silver dime, because, you know, those edges stick out like cheddar cheese. And <laughs> basically, I scored three rolls of 2021 uncirculated quarters. I haven't even seen any of the change yet so far, so I'm actually quite excited that I found these. Who knows, and these could actually be even a lower mintage than uh, the 2020, even though the 2020 is a uh, higher mintage than the 2019. So I have a dealer that might want these. I don't know yet. I know I'm gonna keep one of them. And one of the things that sucks about this is Two of the rolls back to back have heads, so that means that these are going to have to be opened at some point because, well, you won't really know unless if you mark it as 2021, and I don't want to confuse people, so my dealer might have to open it in front of me just to make sure, and I have no problem with that because I know he will probably want some of these. So basically, I'm quite happy about that. And I ended up finding, and getting back in the change, a 1968 50% silver dime. So that's pretty sweet, and I haven't even hunted yet so far today. And then uh, I found this in a dirt parking lot, which is kind of ironic that I found a penny in Canada, even though pennies haven't been around for like about nine years, and it's getting close to about 10 years since we've uh, used the penny last. So, this is quite interesting, and this is just a quick little update. I will be uh, hunting more dimes down the road. I have another bank down the road that actually is getting more dimes this week, so fingers crossed that there's customer wrap rolls or transit rolls. Transit rolls are fun. I love transit rolls. So, uh, before I end this video, one of the rolls of quarters I noticed was very long, and it, I weighed it just to make sure that it weighed the proper weight. It weighed about 200 grams, I think. Yeah, roughly about 200 grams. So I never even got a roll of quarters that weighed that much. And in the last bundle of quarters that I hunted, I ended up finding about $1.55, which was kind of ironic. So I was up to $1.50. So yeah, that's basically it. I hope you guys have a fun time searching those coins, and happy hunting.